out to the trap as we all run back, back, lit is we out of here, out of here. Any man battle rap trap, and we definitely got the streets. D out again, man. D out again, man. Put it on your YouTube. Shout out to the trappers, we all back lit. It's D out of Henny Man Battle Rap Trap, and we definitely got the streets. All right, so URL has officially dropped a response to everything that's been going on. They've officially dropped a statement regarding Easy to Block Captain and everything Easy to Block Captain from contracts to the trenches event that just went down to who's under contract outside of Easy, things like that. So I'm going to go ahead and read y'all the statement off top. Then I'm going to tell y'all where to get it. And I'm also going to attach a statement that was written directly to Easy's lawyer as well in the comments so y'all be able to check out everything that I seen. Off top, here go the statement. I'm going to try my best to read it. Y'all know I read good as shit. Let's go. The Ultimate Rap League earned the title of the world's most respected battle rap arena because of its pioneering work in creating a legitimate business out of a cultural phenomenon originally confined to the hip-hop underground. URL transformed battle rap from an art form to a sport. In doing so, URL created and invested into a system that allows for artists to monetize their talents and have thriving careers as battle rappers. The bond between URL and its artists is cemented by legally binding agreements. These agreements work both ways. URL provides a platform for its artists and markets their prodigious talents. In turn, the artists offer services to URL for which they are paid. Our deals comply with the law to the period. They are fair, the byproduct of negotiation and entered into by the artist of their own free will. Consequently, we are compelled to publicly dispute the false narrative that URL and its affiliates have done anything untoward in seeking to enforce its legally binding contract. As a business, URL has the right to operate like other businesses. The league has to insist that others honor their promise and has the right to enforce its contracts when the artists wrongfully decide to breach them. Anthony Brown, previously known as Easy the Block Captain, has been under contract with URL since April 2020. Despite Easy's decision to breach his agreement by performing in Chrome 23's February 2023 event, his contract remains legally binding. In addition to breaching his contractual obligations, Brown has tried to persuade other artists to breach their contracts with URL. Indeed, upon announcing his Trenches Battle Rap event, Easy approached talent signed to or affiliated with URL. He did this despite the fact that he and his legal counsel were notified not to torturously interfere with URL's artist. URL's demand letter, a copy of which is attached, was sent to Easy's legal team on May 5th, 2023. The letter provided Easy with ample time to modify the card. Despite this fact, Easy consciously elected to promote the card with only minor adjustments, transparently using his dispute with URL as a marketing ploy to help promote his event. Easy's use of the alleged beef with URL to market the Trenches card is nothing more than smoke and mirrors, designed to draw attention to Trenches and paint Easy as a sympathetic figure. URL has not acted in an underhanded manner. The supposed secret calls made to our talent, quote unquote, behind Easy's back, were mere reminders to our artists of their contractual commitments to URL. URL has not attempted to persuade any non roster artist or artists not under a performance contract with the brand from performing at trenches. URL will, as it always has, work with the most talented battle rappers. So yeah, that's the whole statement right there, man. It's getting hot in here, man. You know what I mean? So basically what I take from that is they saying on their side, Easy is still under contract. I did read the lawyer's attached letter and it does clearly say that Easy is still under contract along with a lot of other things y'all definitely want to check out. You know what I mean? We going to be breaking down the whole situation on the live me and Anwar. But for now, y'all got all the information I got. I do want to add... PKA stands for performer known as in this situation, not previously known as. I'm not about to go back and reread it, so I just wanted to let y'all know. Um, in the meantime, in between time, let me know what y'all think and get from this in the comments. I might be able to take some understanding from y'all before we go live and speak on it. Y'all mean it's battle rap trap. We got the streets. Shout out to the trap we are my back back lit. It's the out of here. Any man battle rap trap and we definitely got the streets. D out again, man. D out of internet. Put it on your YouTube.